है बाद मस्त बादा आशा में अहमदेयत चलता है दौर में What is the pin number, please? Uh, four two zero eight three seven zero. Where is the strongest muscle in the body? Oh, was it four two zero? Sorry, eight three seven zero. Is that the bottom of bottom right of the screen? Yeah. Yeah, the the strongest uh, muscle in the body is actually the jaw muscle, and it's called mis it's, it's called mis masita masita is called, yeah. and it's the strongest one. I thought the no tongue one. isn't the tongue one of the strongest. Uh no, I don't think so. Oh, search it up. The one without the bone. Okay, what is the meaning of irreverent? Some uh, something for your vocab here. <laughs> what is the meaning of irreverent? Word of the day. Do you want to use it in a sentence after this? Yeah. <laughs> or is it irrelevant? <laughs> <laughs> so, irreverent actually means uh, disrespectful. So showing a lack of respect for people or things that are generally taken seriously. So uh, when the uh, poses of M, the, you know, talk about all these mass killings they're quite irreverent with their thoughts and their opinions sounds like my two-year-old trying to say irrelevant into <laughs> 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 Ghana mashallah okay what place was known as Caledonia by the Romans Ooh. <laughs> Roman Empire. Yeah, Scotland. So they called the north of uh, the UK Caledonia back then, which is all of Scotland now. Mm. So before you. Um, Zariab, today in uh, I know you like Autogral. Today, as we mentioned, a really amazing incident about Hazrat Mavia and Hazrat Ali. So he was saying that um, I think it was I think he mentioned it was the Roman the Roman they realized that they were having a fight between them, and they wanted to expose it. You know how in Notre Dame they try to always uh, expose people, try to jump in and mess mess. Yeah, with yeah. So they were trying to do the same thing. But then Hazrat Mavia said that you stay there and don't get involved in us. Don't get involved in our own um, matters because if you do, then I will be the first person to stand up and fight against you. Oh was, yeah, yeah, yeah! No, oh my day! Like <laughs> if you try to mess with Muslims, then we'll come together even stronger, and we'll defeat you. Um, so that's, that's what happening at the, at the moment. They're going against each other. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it was nice to see that. Let me listen to it after this. Uh, same question again. What city was called Durali Ponte by the Romans? Durari Ponte. Cambridge, a lot of people knew that, yeah. So we've done it before. Back, the back then, you would have gone to the University of Durali Ponte. It wouldn't have sounded so good. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> Hello, sir. Hello. I'm not taking part in Kahoot as I'm working as well as I'm listening all programs, so I'm just answering in my head. <laughs> Did you get it right? <laughs> <laughs> I have one, sir. Cambridge one is right. All right. <laughs> <laughs> you're you're going to come first. You're going to come first, then. <laughs> no, actually, I didn't know this. <laughs>
This is the name. Just guess. <laughs> mashallah, mashallah. I am on mute now. Yeah, Jazakallah. Union or league? Uh, pardon? Rugby league or rugby union? I didn't. I didn't even know there were two different team sizes. I just thought there was one. But two the bigger one, two. The bigger one, if you know what I mean. <laughs> the bigger number. <laughs> yeah, thirty. So, and so what's that? So, is there a difference then? Yeah, there is. There's, there's one with seven. I think that's the league one, isn't it? Oh, okay. Well, no one selected that, so it's okay. <laughs> Rugby league has thirteen players. Okay. So union has seven then. Uh, which is the only vitamin not present in an egg? Um, A, B, C, D. Yeah, vitamin C is the only one that's not present. So you know, egg, eggs are healthy, man. Get your eggs in. Buy some, buy some orange for vitamin C. I won't forget an orange egg. <laughs> Moshala <laughs> Tengu is doing coming first today. Okay, how many capitals? So South Africa has more than one capital city for some reason. Why is this the government likes having three headquarters? So how many does it have? Three up, you have to say no, you know. Which so much? You you have to say that has more than one. Three, yeah. three, three, uh, we leaked it, man. You give the answer. You said uh, yeah. free, the government have lo love having free headquarters. What's wrong with you? Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I said a few. I said that was a few. You said That's three. Also, also, he said three yeah. as well. You said it nah, has four. What are you taking me for, man? <laughs> you said it has more than one, and I literally, as soon as you said that, I selected one. <laughs> oh, thanks for taking the advice. <laughs> oh. Uh, question eight: Which area of water split for Hazrat Musa This was a hopefully everyone got this. Did it split though? Did it split? That's a debate for another time. <laughs> <laughs> it, it didn't entirely split, you know. Where the it was, um, yeah. Maybe so I'm gonna explain that. <laughs> Have you seen? Have you seen? Uh, there's a joke about it. I don't know if it's, it was on on social media. There was like a, a fish that needed to go to work, and then Hazrat Musa obviously they showed the picture of this the sea splitting, and then the boss asks him, "Why were you late to work?" And then he was like, "You're not going to believe this." <laughs> and then, <laughs> and then the picture of the the splitting of the sea, but with the splitting of the sea, how Khalifa Sani the Zalant has mentioned it is about um, high tide and low tide. So I don't know if you guys ever um, been on the beach with me because I'm from Mauritius. We understand it because we're living on an island. But there's many places where when it's a low tide, it's like a whole other part of the land is revealed. So when Hazrat Musa is his, his companions were, were crossing, it was a low tide. But just after crossing it, the water started rising. So while rising, you know, the water was becoming so high and it happens quite quickly. And that's what they say about the splitting of the sea. It's like um it was a low tide so the path was made and then the path the water came up but it wasn't like a whole a massive sea was in front of him and it just split um so yeah that's how uh, khalifa's i mean okay. uh, let me find it. uh true or false vatican city is a country as well oh, oh, there we go. vatican city has anyone been to vatican city yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a country, isn't it? Yeah, it's its own state, but even though it's surrounded by Rome, it's its own state. I think it has a population of 500 people, making it the smallest country with population <laughs> and land mass. Wow, that's amazing. You have to apply to become one of them, and it's a lot of money. <laughs> wow. Um, how many elements are there on the periodic table? Don't know. Going back many years to science days. Oh, wow. 118 elements. So that's what we found so far of all these different metals. 
Where's where's underscore? Honest, you're doing well. <laughs> Is that rugby question? I got play eleventh. Okay, fill in the blank. What is the most dangerous affliction? It brings about spiritual death for the person whom it is instilled. I know for certain that this affliction is worse than murder, said by the promised Messiah. What is the most dangerous affliction? It is indeed arrogance. So arrogance brings you spiritual death. So crazy. Mashallah. Muslim, Muslim, doing well. Question 12. What is the translation of one when Sherry Hastin is a Hasad? Not reading all those out. <laughs> Hasad. Uh, yeah, and from the evil of the envy, how many envies? What did he say about us? No, I was just, um, I was remembering a scene from Ortugal. Okay. <laughs> they tried oh, to make the kid become a Christian and do dwell. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And he starts reading all these surahs after reading, to... uh, reading Surah Falak to ask Allah to help him from, from the evils of the Christians trying to convert him. What movie is that? No to grow. Watch it. It's really good. Learn a lot. Bro, it's long, man. Like, one season's got about 100 episodes. Yeah. Worth it. I'm, I'm on 250. So, <laughs> <laughs> and it's, sub it's subtitles as well, like. That's yeah. Long. It helps you to read. It's something with you. <laughs> <laughs> what is the name of the part read in standing after Samir Allah, Holy Muhammadah? So what is the actual name of that part? What on earth is Tafazas? Tafazas. Tamid. And just to let you know, Tafaza, is it just a word or made up? I don't know if it's a real word yeah. or not. But yeah, it's called Tamid. <laughs> Tamid. Uh, to praise. Huh? Does it mean to praise? Yeah, yeah. Okay. How many siblings did the promised Messiah have? Ooh, technical question. Does that include the twin sister? <laughs> no, she uh, she passed away unfortunately at death. So I, 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 yeah, I, I, let's make up. <laughs> yeah, he had two siblings. Who are the two siblings? That's for next week then. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and just following on for that, in what position by age was the promised Messiah amongst the siblings? He was indeed the middle child. Oh, and that's just popped out saying, yo. Well, he got out of the top five in a second. <laughs> Two more questions. Go on. Which of the following jobs did the promised Messiah Salam have? He worked this job for four years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was a government clerk in the court. So he did all the office work. In the court. Oh, unless you went the wrong way. <laughs> <laughs> uh, last question today. Uh, fill in the blanks again. Is the attributions that have been mentioned in Surah Fatiha are the attributions of God, and and a man should also. I don't think you think about writing partake, so you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so yeah, partake in them, so you should, should be the most gracious, you should be the most merciful. Obviously, you can't be Lord of all the worlds, but... Hmm. Okay. Oh my God, he made it. He made it, he made it. <laughs> well, mostly did well. But today, guys, I have to say, Leamington, got one over us. Demur, Demur, how do you feel, man, coming first? 
must feel great. <laughs> 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 I love you, Rika.